So according to according to the achievement list, we're missing one gift so far. So my guess is it's got to do with the last chapter, maybe. But uh, let's uh, let's unlock some memories here. Look how perfect this beach looks. Feel like I'm right. Here goes nothing. This will finish out green, or at least it should. You're getting slow, green. Your old bones catching up to you. Keep wasting your breath. Soon you won't have enough to outlast me. I oh, want to bet, Grandpa. Gotcha. Now, now, don't be so hasty. Oh, ow, ow, Jesus, green, stop. What was that? Let go of me. Can't hear you. Come on, ow, crap. Don't make me beg. I would never make you do anything you aren't already willing to do. Friggin' asshole. <laughs> okay, you win. Please, I'm dying here. Well, since you asked nicely. Jesus, you play dirty. I can promise that no one you face out there will be as merciful as I. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right again. Give me 15. My legs feel like they're going to give out. No, no breaks. Again. The hell, seriously? Dead serious. I want you to be as good and ready for the heist. Didn't you say this was an easy score? That will probably won't even run into blue? You probably won't. That rat bastard has lived a life of uninterrupted luxury for so long, he's likely forgotten the existence of any ghosts keen on haunting him. And why are you working us to the bone? This is more than we've ever prepared for any of our other this jobs. Is this is different. It's personal. All our clients pay us to get our hands dirty resolving their conflicts. They don't realize revenge is a dish best served by your own two hands. Red was talking to me about how most people usually wind up forgetting what causes it, caused the fight in the first place. Eventually, all you're left holding on to is a feeling. Red. Red. How does she know? This isn't some petty drama between high school girls. How could I ever forget the man that took everything from me? You built yourself back up real nice, though. Put together a pretty good, pretty golden team. Even to have me, aren't I worth more than any gold and blues coffers? Closure. Closure. The priceless reward. Closure, huh? So once you rob old man blue, that's it? All those years have been... He's been living in your head rent-free, just doesn't matter anymore? So long as I get the last laugh, it'll all be worth it. You think so? I guarantee it. Now, again... Green's done. <laughs> you see, White? There is. That there is a job well done. Should have seen the old bastard huffing and wheezing. <laughs> Probably hadn't touched a weapon in ages. All the guards in the world couldn't have protected no. him. No, they couldn't. They were too busy running after us. The hell are you moping for? We finally got him. Even found out there was the rest of the money is. Where the rest of the... What the fuck did I just say? <laughs> we'll get the money and get out of here just like we planned. They got red. I barely made it out of there with her body. What? Mess. Don't mess with me, boy. You think I'm joking? Look at what they did to her. They got everyone. The hell do you think was going to happen, Green? I trained them the best I could, but sometimes these things happen in our line of work. At least it wasn't for nothing, White. We still won. You call this a win? We lost more than half our team. It's a win. Blue is dead. We'll get the money and... <laughs> you think I want the damn money? It's not going to bring any of them back. White, put the gun down. Don't ruin everything we've worked for. Shut, up. Shut the hell up. You did it. You did that yourself. You left us all behind to fend off the guards. And for what? To kill some old man? The hell am I supposed to do with his corpse? Maybe it means nothing to you, but it means everything to me. Pathetic. Excuse me? How pathetic and sad you let this prune rule your whole miserable life. Don't talk to me like that, boy. 
I just, when I read, I fuck up the lines and then I just add words. <laughs> uh, you don't know what it's like to lose everything to the man you trusted most. You couldn't possibly understand. Oh, I think I understand perfectly well. You just did the same goddamn thing. Ah. And pants. So that's how it is, white. <laughs> After everything I've given you, how do you take a drink? You used me. You used all of us. You might as have gotten away with it too if it wasn't for these meddling guards. But they didn't. And you're not even the least bit sorry for that, are you? Well. <laughs> what, are you what are you waiting for? Go on. Finish me. This is what you wanted, isn't it? Blue screen. I heard them over here. You're not worth it. I'm getting red out of here. Get him. Should have known it was going to end this way. God's sick sense of humor or something. Neat. All right. Finish up Raz and Red. What oh, the fuck the last gift would be? I'm glad to see you're opening up, White. Great timing, too. I just finished making this for you. Oh, you made us a little red doll. That was nice of him. Oh, shit. We have a side quest for her. Oh, you think we're missing a red? A red gift? Oh, shit. Holy hell, this is going to be hard. Maybe it's not that hard, it's just slow and steady wins the race. Yeah. Okay, it wasn't that hard, it's just slow and steady wins the race. Maybe we are going to finish Red off. Red sort, uh, side character. Yeah, we did. Ah, there's too many of them. Come on, White, this way. Red? Have you seen the others? Yes, damn but... It. Damn it. We should have never split up. Where the hell is Green? He ran off a while back. He was after Blue. Of course. That's the real reason we're here, isn't it? We're all just... Disposable pawns in Green's stupid little game. I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? I really, I really wanted to believe he got us into this mess. He'd know how to get us out of it without any casualties. Well, we know the truth. He hates Blue more than he cares about us. Maybe there's once in a time when he, when that wasn't the case, but that's just the way it is now. Shoot. I hear guards outside the door. We should have run that night. We had the chance. How would you have known things would turn out this way? Green promised you would be safe after all. Despite our concerns. 
Yeah, but I... I knew he was full of it. What? I let myself be persuaded at first, but the truth only came became more clear as time went on. But y you told us, you... You assured us it would be okay, that Green had you conv so convinced. Oh, yeah. I... I was just following orders. But it'd never come if I'd known you doubted him. Sorry. I didn't know what to do. I was scared to make the wrong choice. Excuse me. So you let Green make the choice for you? I'm not like you. All this time I've ever put my life into Green's hands. But you. You were totally willing to leave it all behind. To venture into the unknown completely unprepared. That idea was terrifying to me. It, that was... That it was just... That it was easier to just swallow Green's lies and pray that we'd make it through. I was scared too, White. But I knew whatever was out there would be worth enduring. So long as I was alive. So long as I was with you. Let me break down this door. What? We're getting out of here. But they're all still out there. It's the only route we have left. We won't make it. We will. We have to. We'll have to make a run for it, and we'll live. Okay? Okay. Now, the count of three. One, two, three. White, watch out! Red! No! Not red! White, I'm coming in. Hey. Hey. Hey, you wanted to meet with me? I, uh... Yeah, I, uh... Been starting to remember a lot more from our past. Oh, what do you remember? Mostly how much of a coward I was and how I should have left with you. At night, when you talked about running away, getting a cabin. We should have taken what we had left. Wait. Following Green felt easier than standing up to him. I'm so sorry, I... Mm. Hush, I've already forgiven you, dummy. I'm just happy to have you back, White. I'm glad to be back. I finally feel myself again. Do you now? If I could do this over again, I think. I'm not paying you to think. What should I do? Completely up to you. Oh, we unlocked the red rush. Which is terrifying to me. Yeah, what the fuck's the last gift I gotta get? It's about time, bro. What, for real? Beer time, beer time, beer time. We haven't even done a job today. Dude, did you see how many boxes of bullets I carried in? That was some honest work, man. I don't know about honest, but I, would, I wouldn't say no to a cold one if you're offering. Right on, bro. Cheers, mate. And the wise words of the Queen of England. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Cheers. So you ready for our final score? I guess. You guess? I thought you said it was going to be a piece of cake. I mean, it is. At least that's what Green says anyway. I've been thinking. We're robbing his old boss, right? Kind of funny you think about it. Big guy like Green taking orders. Yeah, Green's always going off about how much stronger he was compared to the old man Blue. If it was true, how do you end up with all the dough? How did Blue end up with all the dough? By being a huge asshole? Damn. So that's the secret of being rich? <laughs> Pretty much. Apparently they had a huge job together, but as soon as things went south, Blue made off with the money and abandoned the theme. Yikes. Yikes, no wonder Green's always so cranky. What do you think he's going to do with his cut? Uh, who knows? I know I've just been thinking about all the places I plan on traveling with Red once this is over. About you? Hmm. Maybe I'll open up a bar, give people a chill zone to hang out, play some sick beats and drink the night away. Well. Sounds like heaven. The future is bright, buddy. Yeah, but... Doesn't it also make you kind of sad? I mean, once this job is over, beer time will be over too. Hey, that's not true. Come on, bro. Be for real. You'll be off traveling the globe with Red. Violet will be doing whatever Violet does. It will have the time. Kind of like high school. Spend every day with your classmates till graduation comes along. Then after you cross that stage, you'll never see those guys again. To be honest, I didn't think you graduated high school. The hell does your GPA even look like? GPA, what's that? Grand Theft Auto? Never mind. Rest assured, this is nothing like high school. 
Red and I will grow weary of vacationing eventually. And then when we do, we'll stop at your bar, crack open some cold ones, and reminisce about the good old days. <laughs> yeah? Definitely. Hell yeah. I'll, it'll be all in the house, bro. The future to a future filled with beer. <laughs> yes, the beer. Yo, white! Yo, white! Yellow? Man, dying twice sucks. How? Are you talking to me right now? I don't know, but I, it's like I'm a ghost. I mean, technically, never mind. Look, I'm sorry about everything. I can't believe I got you killed in life and death. It's all my fault. Dude, slow down. I should have listened to you, bro. I knew we were really going through it with the boss and stuff. I just figured I could make you laugh. It would be all chill. It was more than enough for me, I promise. You're always there for me, Yellow. You even took a bullet for me in the end. Or a stab for me, I guess. <laughs> I'm here. For, <laughs> I'm still here for you, watching over you like a guardian angel. Close enough. As your gardening angel, <laughs> I pass on my wisdom. Green's like a final boss, but with your skills, there's no way he stands a chance, dude. Just don't forget to dodge and roll. You can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a bullet. Is that the Oh shit, we're missing a violet gift. Huh. So that's what we're missing. Interesting. Hey, 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 quit yanking on me. I've already told you I got too much work to do at the office. Uh-huh. And when's the last time you took a break? Exactly. I've got a deadline. Uh-huh. But you always say, because it's always true. That's all the more reason to get outside and breathe in some friggin' fresh air. Bah. You're gonna go crazy if you don't see the sights from somewhere other than your window every now and then. I guess you're right. I hardly get any sun anymore. That's probably why you're such a curmudgeon. Don't make me smack you, kid. I know I have the tendency to bury my head at my job, but I can't help it. Sometimes working is the best distraction from all the bad thoughts that accumulate in your rotten little mind. Yeah. Yeah, I, I know the feeling. What are you thinking about right now? Hmm. I'm thinking about a nice, how a nice breeze feels. I guess you could say this is already a nicer distraction than the office, huh? All right, wise guy, you made your point. And hey, um, while we're out here, maybe you could, uh, I don't know, buy me a pretzel? Damn it, kid. I knew you had an ulterior motives for dragging me outside. <laughs> Have someone else buy it for you. But Mikey, you have the fattest wallet of all the angels I know. I'm gonna kick your ass one day, you know? Neat. All right. That's going to be it for this episode. And when we come back, let's jump into it, shall we? Take it easy. Peace.